You and all praise on the glory to Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai by Hashem, Rechach with Ash, the born of the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone. And it's a sincere shalom to the Akin that's out there pushing the sincerity and the truth and the sound doctrine. Um, This is going to be a really quick video. Really, 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 really quick video. This is a video put up by GMS South Carolina 08. Um, and, you know, this, this is not going to be, like I said, the main reason it's not going to be quick. I mean, it's going to be quick is because, well, they would already went into it, so there's not very much to go into with this, you know. Um, but when when I was listening to this guy talk, I think the elder said his name was John Cannon or something like that. When I was listening to this muscle head talk, um, he was pretty much so, so the point of his video was because you see here the way he titled his Hebrew Israelites are learning. So what he Pretty much to summarize what he was talking about, he said back in the day, you know, he would be kind of like, you know, not making eye contact with people and this, this, that, and the other. And, you know, and this was probably before he hit the gym. You know what I'm saying? It's, that's that's probably what happened. It was probably before he hit the gym. And like the elder said, you know, you get you hit the gym, you get some muscles. I know how it is. You, you go to the gym, you get some muscles. You know what I'm saying? You feel good, right? You feel confident. But that confidence is going to get you messed up, bro. I'm just saying. You know, you got righteous confidence. You got you got unrighteous confidence. Okay. So, like what he like he made the um, example is those salesmen that those salespeople that be at Walmart. He said he would he used to kind of like walk around. And now he just walks past them and make eye contact. You know what I'm saying? And they make eye contact and they keep walking. You know. So now now he's he's just you know excuse the language. Now he's the shit. You know what I'm saying? Now he's now he's somebody. You know he gained some muscle, right? He probably got a couple of women hitting on him or whatever, right? But those muscle heads be the but be the ones getting messed up, man, because their confidence had clouded their judgment. That's un that's what a confidence gets unrighteous. Now what he's talking about is the Hebrew Israelites, how. He said we so called, so called used to harass just everybody. I don't know where he get harassment from. Half of them don't even know what's going on. They see videos and then everybody cuts out the video and just see a bunch of yelling and back and forth and stuff like that. Little little do they know that most of the time when these con when these conflicts come up, it be people coming up. Right? People come people come up and they start the whole argument. They start the whole the whole thing. Right, and he even said he even said in in the in the video he said yeah they, they they got a homeless guy, you know what I'm saying? They got a homeless guy. They know who the, they know who the, they know who to the f with now. You know what I'm saying? They know who to the f with now. That's what he said. He said he walked past the Israelites and uh, made eye contact and like like I said like he's somebody like 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 somebody scared of him. Now my question is like I left on the elders comment board, so Jake wants to be harassed now after all this time they sent of y'all talking about y'all need to stop harassing people y'all need to stop yelling at people y'all need to do this y'all need to do that and now the one time that, that that nobody feels like dealing with you now all of a sudden we, we label this cowards we know we know but you but you only he said we can only mess with crazy people they know who to, they know who to f with don't f with us don't do that don't do that bro i ain't gonna lie to you I've seen guys like you a thousand times, man, get handled by people that really aren't even fighters, by people that try their very best to avoid fights. A thousand times. And number one, it's all over the internet. The people that you you wouldn't even guess but would take down a muscle head like you in a, in a heartbeat, man. You need to chill out, man. You know what I'm saying? Jake. But again, this is why I'm this is why I'm baffled. This is why I'm baffled because this is like now all of a sudden the Israelites don't don't say nothing to you. Everything's peaceful, and here you are doing a video looking for some trouble. Now you're looking for trouble. I'm I'm confused, man. I'm confused. After all this time, y'all say y'all need we need to stop doing this. We need to stop doing that. We the Israelites don't say nothing. The Hebrew Israelites don't say nothing to you this time. They ain't yelling. They they ain't so called yelling, harassing you, so called, right? And now and now you want you want us to say something to you now. 
right? No, Jake are a bunch of knuckleheads, man. But like the elder said, honestly, to be honest, you really should be concerned about that, right? What y'all doing is labeling, you know, what we do as harassment. I want to know what y'all definition of harassment is, right? And we have been doing we we have been doing the same thing since the start. I'm not understanding what what this Jake is talking about that is any different. How many people? How many camps do you see out there? And thousands of people just walk by. He said he's just harassing everybody. I mean everybody. Where are you getting this from? Half of y'all don't know what's going on. Y'all ride past you. You don't know what's going on. You get people that cut videos and even other Israelites that cut videos and it's just a bunch of yelling back and forth. But you have no idea what's going on. None of y'all sit around and watch the whole video. Y'all, Everybody looks for some drama. So I'm not understanding. What difference is it? It'd be jakes like you that come up and start and start the confusion. And then you pull out your phone. See, see, these Hebrews are like so crazy. This is why we don't deal with y'all, especially us at Great Millstone, man. We only really concerned with the elect, man. We ain't, we ain't concerned about y'all, man. And that's exactly why the elder, and one of the reasons why the elder said you should be concerned about that. Right? But Jake, they're not spiritual. They just look at Hebrew Israelites. It's just crazy Negroes on the, on, the, on the corner with beards and garments on and stuff like that. I think he was specifically talking about IUIC. Okay. Uh, anyway, Isaiah chapter 65, verse 13. Therefore, thus saith the Lord, Behold, my servant shall eat, but ye shall be hungry. Behold, my servant shall drink, but ye shall be thirsty. Behold, my servant shall, shall rejoice, but ye shall be ashamed. And that day, man, you gonna wish you gonna wish that they said something to you. I can guarantee you, man, if you're not of the elect, you gonna wish that they said something to you instead of going back and bragging about, yeah, they know they know, they learning, they know who to mess with. Yeah, I agree with you. We we yeah, Israelites are learning, they learn we learning more and more, right? Of who of who to talk to and who not to talk to. Who's full of shit and who ain't. The them them Israelites probably saw that you they so uh Excuse the language, but the Israelites saw that you probably saw that you was full of shit, right? We do it. We stand out there on the highways and on the hedges, and when we see a bugged out Jake walk by, we let him. But we we let him walk by. We don't. We we let him walk by. If we see a Jake is full of shit and they standing up with their with their crazy doctrines or whatever, we we gonna be real quick to dismiss it and walk. Send them on down the street, or we just ain't gonna say nothing. We ain't gonna say nothing to them. We let them keep walking. Yeah, we're learning more. You're right. We are learning. We're learning more and more about Jake's like you. Knowing that we can't that we can't teach nobody like you. Cause you got too much arrogance. You got too much pride. And the Lord is gonna break that break break all that pride away, man. He's gonna snatch all that pride away. We know not to talk to a prideful Jake. Now, if you come up and you decide to deal with us, yeah, we're gonna deal with you. But we ain't just going outright to, brother, brother, come on, man, brother, brother, come on, man. We ain't going to do that no more. We ain't, we ain't in the time for that. If that's what you're talking about, then that's different. Then we ain't doing different times. You all understand, man. Time is short. And we got prophesying to do. We don't got the time to be dealing with knucklehead niggas like you, man. This is what it is. This is why we don't go back and forth with scoffers on the comment board. We don't have the time. We don't have time. Time is so short. So if you want to say we learning, sure, we learning, but not in the way you think. Right? Not in the way you thinking. Right? You know, we they know who to mess with. They know who to F with. I got news for you, man. Some of them Israelites out there carry guns. You gonna you gonna you gonna you gonna have that same attitude with a gun pointed to you? You know what I'm saying? That's what I'm talking about, man. That that so called confidence, that unrighteous confidence. Mm. And usually in movies, those hot heads are the ones that get messed up the most. There's a reason why they keep putting that stuff in the movies. And this is one of those jakes. Those one of them hot head jakes. Okay? 
It says, Behold, my servant shall eat, but ye shall be hungry. It says, Behold, my servant shall drink, but ye shall be thirsty. Behold, my ser servants shall rejoice, right? But ye shall be ashamed. Let's get the whole thing real quick. Right? Verse 14. It says, uh, Behold, my servant shall, shall, so I can behold my servants shall sing for joy of heart, right? But ye shall cry for uh, sorrow of heart, right? And shall howl for vexation of spirit. You see that? This is only about a service, and that's all we really care. That's all we really care about. These other, most of these other Israelite camps, you know, they keep talking about, you know, black black people wake up, you know, this, this, that, and the other, you know, very, you know, black, you know, black, uh, you know, man, woman, child, brother, sister, child, whatever. One thing we understand, especially us at Great Millstone, see when you meet when you meet Great Millstone, we differ from most most of these ninety nine percent of these camps out here, man. If not all of these camps out here, okay, we carry it differently, right? We carry it way differently. We are only concerned with with the brothers and the sisters. The rest of these little rats out here, these two thirds like this muscle headed rat, right? We not we not concerned about you. We don't care about you. You over here talking. You over here thinking that we that we supposed to say something. And then when and then what's crazy is when we do say something, you want to. This wouldn't be the video you would do, right? The the video you would do is man, them Hebrew Israelites, man, they over here harassing people, man. They crazy, man. They just crazy. So Dan, if we do, Dan, if we don't with Jake, man. Dan, if we do, Dan, if we don't with Jake. We we say something to him, oh, you're harassing me. We don't say something to him, oh, they cowards. They know who to mess with. Don't mess with us. They know who to mess with. I mess with, I, I F with them, man. I F with that. No, you don't. You don't know what's going on, man. And a lot of y'all don't. So the question is, do you want us to say something to you or do you not? Like, do you want to be quote unquote harassed or do you not? Y'all, Jake, Jake is, Jake are clowns, man. The, the nation of Israel are just, are just clowns right now. <laughs> Whatever. Anyway, you know, like, like you got Matthew chapter 13, verse nine. It's given to you to know, know the mysteries of the kingdom of heaven, but to them, like this muscle head Jake, it's not given to him, man. Right? It's not given to him. And we're not concerned with you. Now, now all of a sudden, you somebody that we supposed to say something to you. Or else, yeah, yeah, they, yeah, I got them. I got them shook. <laughs> I got them shook. They know not to mess with me. I'll lay all them out. And that's not what he said in the video, but I'm just saying that's what he, you know, in the, in the, that's his mindset. Anyway, you know, that's pretty much all I got on this. Jake, man, the nation of Israel is just a bunch of clowns and the Lord has really degenerated us to that. Right? So anyway, giving all praise on the glory to you. How about you? Shalom.